Hey, what's up? This is Mark D Tech. Showing you a tech review for Artist Studio 2. You can download this program in the more info section on the right hand side of this video. Okay, so you can try and you, when you download it, you're going to see this is a trial program. You can buy it later or, or activate it. By purchasing, it'll remove the Artist Studio watermarks. So that's pretty much it. It'll do. You can do try standard edition. Try standard edition is will give you more stuff than home edition. Artist Studio lets you make templates for programs such as bloggers, Joomla, uh, Joomla, WordPress, Drupal, and .NET Nuke, and you can do for a website, HTML, ASP.NET application, and Code Charge Studio. Okay, I'm gonna pick a uh, WordPress theme since everybody likes using WordPress for some reason. Yep. And you see here it gives you a pre-made layout. Okay. And you're gonna click on suggest design. What RST really does is let you create a design for a template. So say you like this template right here that I suggested. But you don't like the colors. Well you can pick a new color. Uh no, not purple. Yeah, brownish is good. And you want to suggest fonts. You, if you don't like the fonts, okay, Times New Roman kind of looks nice. Suggest layout. You can go with that new new menu bar. It'll suggest everything new. Okay, maybe you don't like the width. Okay, and you don't like the background. Okay. Everything's customizable. You can pick color theme. Say I want a uh, black and white. Or is black and white? There's black and white. And that's pretty nice right there. You can pick. You can nitpick about anything you want. Uh. See the background you can nitpick. From you can pick from a file. You can change the color. Say maybe you want. Let me see what. In there. Okay. Oh, that's nice. Maybe you want to. There's a whole bunch of stuff you can do. You can change the border if you want a border on it. You can put. Uh, hold on. You can make your headline, which I already took off accidentally, so let me. Hold on. Header. Layout. There it is. Page layout. Header menu. Yeah, there is header back in. And I'll, put, I'll go back to header. You can change it. You can put somebody in it. It has to be A, P, and G. So that it'll erase everything on the side. And make sure it's transparent. Let me see if I have a file that I can use to demonstrate this effect. Uh, that's a GIF. There's a PNG. There. Let me see. Make sure it's in the right. Um, it's big enough, but not, but not, uh, but not this big. Let me see if I. Yeah, you can edit the size. So it'll go like that. www.mj96.tk. That's my website. And you can change the buttons like that. You can change the coloring. Maybe you want it to show like that when you run that with a certain web page. You can go to article design. You can change the picture. Uh, you can do a whole bunch of stuff. You can go out blocks. You can change how to, the spacing and all that kind of stuff. Go uh, buttons. How to design? You can go footer. The footer is down here, and you see the art steer bottom mark right there. And here's the footer. You can change anything. Let's see. Uh, do you make it RSS reader different type of picture? 
there is a lot of stuff you can do with this thing. So check back in. This is artist deer too. So oh yeah. And you can export it to your desktop or it in the format you want it, as a zip or in a folder. And you make it into also an HTML page or blogger, nuke or anything like that. Okay. Check back in for more videos. This is Mark D Tech. Subscribe, rate, and comment. And follow me at twitter.com forward slash Mark DeGraco.